So this is our litter of four that I want to go over with you guys. So what are you looking for as a junior to see how I would place them and what you're looking for? So this is a doe, this is a buck, this is a doe, and this is a buck. How I would place them today, I like this doe. She has very strong shoulders when you first start out, very thick over the midsection and full all the way to the table. She is a very nice balanced rabbit. When they're structurally made, they will sit easily without being pushed into a pose. This is only the second time this little girl has been posed, so she is pretty cute. So the next one I would place would be this little junior buck. He's eight weeks old and was shown twice today. He won best opposite sex of breed in youth. He also won best opposite sex of group in the second show. So structurally he is made properly since he can easily go into a pose without being manipulated. Third is this little junior buck. He just doesn't, he's a little bit less wide in the shoulder. He's balanced for him. He's just a lot smaller than the other two. I'm not saying he wouldn't be uh, worth keeping in the breeding program. I just like a little bit more shoulder when I first start out on the breed itself. And believe it or not, this is part of the litter as well. She is also valuable in the breeding program because she is on the bigger side. So you do want to keep some of these bigger does just for like this little buck. If they weren't related, I probably would put this as a pair. So then you could get better in the next generation. So your brood does are invaluable moving forward in the breed.